Hey yo, check it out. I got all the cages in the game in every scroll too. If you want to be as lucky as your boy, simply like and subscribe for some extra luck and I promise you'll get what you're aiming for. Before we get into the video, if you didn't join my Discord yet, I highly suggest you click the first link in the description and join my Discord if you play Shinobi Life 2. In this Discord, we have a coach channel. We update you with the latest Shinobi Life 2 codes. We also have a scroll location channel. In this channel, we have a picture of every single scroll location. We have a server coach channel. In this channel, we're going to drop a document soon with lots and lots of private servers. Check it out. There's a document being worked on and every single code in this picture is currently working. So you guys could use these codes to server hop or whatever you want to do. Once the document drops, every section should be filled you should have a bunch of sand village servers miss village servers akoski base yo join up the server boys we have a bunch of channels that would benefit you shinobi life 2 players what do you got to lose join the server and if you end up not liking the server you could always leave Hey, what is up guys it's your brother summer 2 and back with another video and on today's video i'm going to be providing you with the two recent codes that just dropped so one dropped yesterday and one just dropped literally like five minutes ago boys all right with that being said let's start redeeming the two recent codes so yeah while i'm redeeming them if you guys haven't redeemed them i highly suggest you redeem them with me before they expire you don't want to end up waiting and then they expire and then you know you don't end up redeeming them that's going to be a huge l for you with that being said let's redeem the code that came out yesterday which is big hungry b capital o one explanation mark i already used it next code which is the one that just came out five minutes ago b three l three i e v three e t explanation mark and this code gives 15 spins, boys. There you go. That's the two recent and working codes on Shinobi Life 2 at the moment. I don't think there's any more working codes out there at the moment. So that's the only two codes you could redeem. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comment section below. But I believe I'm right. With that being said, let's hop on the game and let's start showcasing the two new KTs, Paper and Itachi Monkey Key. So this is how I was going to go. So I'm basically going to go around, find online players to attack. And I'm going to basically showcase some moves by attacking the online players. So I'm going to start off by using the first paper move on this online player right here. So check it out. Pretty clean, pretty clean. This dude wants to smoke. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. Bro, chill. Oh, hell no, bro. He's lucky I don't got my move set on right now. I'm going to reset. Bruh. He bugging. You really think I'm gonna let him body me and then let him grip me? Nah, nah, nah. Next victim, next victim. All right, I'm gonna use the second move on this play right here. You know what? Same play that attacked me. Let's get it. I'm gonna use this move. Check it out. So it makes him just fall on the ground uh, and just stay on the ground for a few seconds vulnerable. So that's low key pretty broken. So if you land this move, you can easily combo on them. You know? They're like vulnerable. Look, check it out. Check it out. I'm about to make him vulnerable by landing this shuriken on him. Look, look, check this out. Check this out. Look at him. Look at him. He can't do nothing. That's pretty broken. All right. The last move on paper is move right here. That's the last move right there. I don't know why he keeps attacking me, bro. Eesh. But yeah, that's the last move. Now let's activate the mode. Let's get it. The mode is low-key my favorite. Uh, check out the mode. It's pretty clean. Check it out. Check it out. Ooh. Y'all see this? Oh, that looks pretty clean. No cap. Alright, so this is the special move that the mode has to offer. And honestly, that's Loki my favorite move this whole KG has to offer. Which is this move right here. Check it out. Here's the move. Check that out. Check that out. Bang. Yo. Y'all see this? That's pretty broken if you ask me. Alright, next up is Itachi Monkey Q. Already know the vibes, boys. So we're going to equip the first move, second move, and then third move. And then let's deactivate the paper KG. Activate the Itachi Monkey Q. Bang. Alright, so this is the first stage. You know, you get no Sasano. You feel me? Just regular combat. This is the second stage right here. You know, this little Sasano appears. Pretty cool. Uh, if you block, this Sasano appears. Pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool. Uh, and then this is stage three, which is the last stage. A big Sasano appears. It's pretty cool. So, pretty cool. Not gonna lie, Itachi Monkey Q is currently my favorite KG in the game and the most broken KG in the whole game, in my opinion. Um, but yeah, with that being said, let's showcase the first move. All right, so this is our first victim. All right, so this is the first move. So what this move basically does is, uh, uh, how, how can I explain this? So 
it basically allows you to like dodge all the hits from your opponents and then once the move is finished being used it spawns a clone of you and then it okay so let me use it let me use it it's really hard to explain all right this kid really wants to smoke bro yo i really hope he's still around once i'm done showcasing these kg because once i equip my moveset it's clip for him all right because he's gonna be tight all right so uh instead of explaining the first move how it works i'm just gonna use it so as you can see it spawned a shadow clone and th that basically happens to distract your opponent to make him think that's you so you could escape or run away um which is pretty cool all right i'm gonna use it one more time so when you use it right now if the player tries to hit you they can't hit you once the clone spawns then that's when the player could hit you but yeah like i said the clone spawns to distract the player most of the time the players are gonna think that the clone is you most of the time <laughs> which is pretty cool if you play it right our right, second move is a jinjutsu so let's use it on a random player and i'm gonna play a clip of how it works from the creators videos um if it's being used on you but yeah with that being said let's use it on this player right here all right so that's how it looks like um you know the Tachi Makiku's user's perspective when he uses it. You know, the player can't do nothing. He's literally in a in jutsu. All he could do is just run around and jump, but he can't really see what he's doing. So he's basically vulnerable for like a good 10 to 15 seconds. That's pretty broken. And yeah, now the last move that Tachi Makiku has to offer, which is pretty broken. So it basically shoots out black flames and attacks any players near you yeah you don't even have to aim it like it goes straight to the players it's pretty broken pretty broken so like let's say there's five players right here the black flames will attack all five players not one player all five that's pretty broken if you ask me all right now let's activate this bad boy all right All right, time to activate this bad boy. Let's get it. <clears throat> All right, so let's activate third stage. And so I forgot what this move is called, but if you um, hold down the right click on your mouse and press C, the Sano does this, which is pretty OP. I don't, I don't know what the move does, and I forgot the name of the move. So let me know in the comment section below what the move's name is and what it does. And yeah, for those of you that are curious and confused about the move like me, just go to the comments and people are going to help you out. They're going to comment in the comment section below explaining what the move is and what it does. Uh, with that being said, let me fix up my moveset and start attacking random online players. Like, giving him my all this time. Not showcasing KGs. I'm going to actually give him my all and put up a fight. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy the rest of the video. If you haven't yet, smash that like button for daily videos and streams. And... Most importantly, subscribe and turn on notifications. I think I'm good. Yeah, we good. All right. Is you really attacking me, bro? Bro, you're lucky you're not at max level. I would have bodied him. All right, so I'm going to let him be. I'm not trying to attack a level 300. I'm not that low. <laughs> All right, where's that dude that was attacking me earlier? Nowhere to be found. Wait, I think that's him. I think that's him. I'm not really sure. All right, so it is what it is. He's going to be the first victim. Let's get it. Let's get it. Bro, this is on was so OP, bro. Check it out. Check it out. Look how OP it is, boy. Bro, if oh my god. If he didn't run away, I would have been able to kill him in, in like 10 seconds with the Susano. Susano does a good amount of damage. No cap. Look, I just killed this dude with the Susano. Bruh. But I'm telling you, the Susano is pretty broken, bro. Y'all see this? Like, bro, this dude. <laughs> this dude can't do anything. I just made this dude respawn. Yo, the power of the Itachi Monkey Kill, I'm telling you boys, the Itachi KG is currently the strongest KG, in my opinion, it might be a fact. Alright, oh, he's using Zawardo, okay, okay, he's using the Zawardo move, let's get it. Where you at, bro? How you gonna use the Zawardo move and then run away, bro? At least combo. Feel me? Like, bro, if you're gonna use that move, at least <laughs> do a combo, bro. I just make that dude rage quit. I'm telling you, Itachi KG is too powerful, bro. Either makes people respawn or rage quit. <laughs> like, bro, they already know. They already know the drill. If it's a manga Q user, they're out. They already know how it's gonna go down. <laughs> but yeah, let's, let's find another victim. Um, they're too low level. Not level. He's not actually. He's level seven hundred. Let's give him the works real quick. Bruh. Okay, that was good timing. Um, yeah. So where he at? Where he at? Bro, this dude is annoying. 
Is a Wardle user. I mean, the Namakaze user. Where you at, bro? Like, bro, how you finna come and then use Namakaze and dip? He's right here. He's right here. All right. He wants to smoke. He wants to smoke. Black Flames time. Okay, where you at? Where you at? This dude is running, bro. He's right here. Why is you running, bro? Fight like a man. Hey. <laughs> you saw the sign of he out. You don't want the smoke, boys. You don't want the smoke. All right, all right, bro. You know what? Hold the shuriken real quick. Let's go play at that game. Let's get it. Let's get it, bro. The power of the Itachi Monkey Q. Look at him running. You better dip. <laughs> you already know the vibes. <laughs> I don't think he's gonna take a chance, boys. He's dipping. He's dipping. Oh, now nah, he actually wants to smoke. He actually wants to smoke. I just killed someone with Itachi Sasano. <laughs> bro, Itachi Sasano is too OP, I'm telling you, boys. Bro, I'm stuck, bruh. Yo, this kid really wants to smoke. Okay, here, hold these black flames real quick, bro. Where you at? Where you at? This dude keeps disappearing. <laughs> what a wuss. Look at him. Look at him running around. Like a... Okay, I got you. Okay, hold this. Easy. Easy, bro. That was easy. That was easy, bro. All right, now let me dance on his body real quick. He said, "Finally, what you mean, finally, bro? Bro, I was showcasing the new KGs for a video. I just started. Hey, serious? Right now. Don't get high. <laughs> He's high, boys. <laughs> Man said, finally." <laughs> <laughs> Get danced on bro <laughs> Alright boys hopefully you guys enjoyed this video If you guys want to see more videos like this Simply like the video Subscribe and turn on notifications for daily content <laughs>